Russia began using Syrian tactics in Ukraine, U.S. representative at OSCE. Russian troops in Ukraine are repeating their own tactics in Syria, launching repeated air and missile strikes against civilians. I would like to focus on the likely reports that the Russian military is carrying out repeated strikes in Ukraine targeting civilians, including paramedics and those arriving to help victims of the first strike. The Russian government is following its own example in Syria, where it carried out dozens of such airstrikes, resulting in the deaths of civilians, emergency services and humanitarian workers. Charge d'affaires of the U.S. mission to the OSCE, Timothy Gunway, said during a meeting of the OSCE Permanent Council. According to the diplomat, in the 2022 report of the OSCE Moscow Mechanism, experts noted clear patterns of violation of international humanitarian law by Russian troops during the conduct of hostilities. Separately, repeated attacks on the civilian population were considered, in particular the caliber strike on March 1, 2022, on Freedom Square in front of the Kharkov Regional State Administration. Five to seven minutes after the rescuers arrived, there was a second attack from a similar missile that hit the building. This means that the rescuers and those wounded from the first attack were deliberately targeted. Gunway explained. He added that evidence has since emerged that the aggressor country has killed more than 90 medical workers, police officers and firefighters and injured nearly 350 civilians across Ukraine using these tactics. It is concerning that Russia is increasingly using this type of attack. The UN Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs said there has been a particularly worrying pattern of such attacks in recent weeks. In March and April alone, repeated Russian attacks targeting those who are the first to respond to emergencies. About 30 rescuers died in Odessa, Kharkov and Zaporozhi and more than 20 were injured. The diplomat was indignant. Gunway stressed that violations of international humanitarian law by the occupiers should not go unpunished and this Russian campaign against the civilian population of Ukraine must be stopped.
Thank you.